Plumes of smoke and the sound of artillery fire signaled that the ceasefire, agreed just hours earlier, had failed, and the battle for Kigali was on once again. Fighting in and around the capital has raged almost without pause since Rwanda's bloody tribal war erupted in April. And this week, fearing the French troops would rob them of victory, Tutsi rebels renewed their push to wrest control of Kigali from the Hutu-led government. The upsurge in the fighting forced the United Nations to suspend plans to evacuate 600 refugees, mostly children, to safety. Then a brief lull allowed 70 people to be whisked away from an overcrowded Red Cross hospital. But the fighting has, for the most part, halted any large-scale transfer of civilians for a week. Meantime, leaders of the European Union meeting on Corfu have backed the arrival of French troops in Rwanda. But still, there's been no offer of the extra troops and help that Paris wants so badly.